Welcome back to our channel, where today we're delving into the intriguing dating history of none other than the enigmatic Hollywood legend, Keanu Reeves. From his early days in the industry to his recent high-profile relationships, we'll be uncovering the fascinating journey of love in the life of this beloved actor. So let's begin. Jill Sholin and Keanu Reeves' relationship was one of Hollywood's most talked-about romances in the late 1980s. The two young actors met on the set of the 1986 film Babes in Toyland, and their on-screen chemistry quickly translated into a real-life romance. Sholin and Reeves were inseparable for the next three years. However, their relationship was not without its challenges. Both actors were at the beginning of their careers, and they were often filming on separate projects. They also had different personalities. Sholin was outgoing and extroverted, while Reeves was more reserved and introverted. In the end, the distance and their different personalities put a strain on their relationship, and they broke up in 1989. Sofia Coppola and Keanu Reeves dated briefly in the early 1990s after meeting on the set of Bram Stoker's Dracula, directed by Sofia's father, Francis Ford Coppola. They reportedly split up in 1992, but have remained friendly over the years. In 2023, the two reunited for a Suntory whiskey ad, which was directed by Coppola. Reeves said that it was cool to work with Coppola again, and that he was excited about the opportunity. Keanu Reeves and Winona Ryder have a long and complicated relationship. They first met in 1988 at a Hollywood party, and they quickly became friends. They starred together in the 1992 film Bram Stoker's Dracula, in which they played on-screen lovers. During filming, they developed a close bond, and many people believed that they fell in love. However, Reeves and Ryder have never publicly confirmed that they were ever romantically involved. They have always said that they are just very close friends. In fact, Ryder has joked that they may be married, since they filmed a real wedding ceremony for their scene in Dracula. Over the years, Reeves and Ryder have starred in several other films together, including A Scanner Darkly, The Private Lives of Pippa Lee, and Destination Wedding. They have also supported each other through difficult times in their lives. For example, Reeves was there for Ryder when she was arrested for shoplifting in 2001. Reeves and Ryder's relationship is one of the most enduring and enigmatic in Hollywood. They are both private people, so they have never shared many details about their friendship. Keanu Reeves and Autumn McIntosh first dated in 1994, but broke up after a year. They rekindled their romance in 2004 and were reportedly engaged in 2005. That same year, reports surfaced that Reeves and McIntosh were secretly married in a private ceremony. However, Reeves has never publicly confirmed their engagement or marriage. Keanu Reeves and Sandra Bullock have been friends for over 30 years. They met on the set of the 1994 film Speed, in which they played love interests. The two had undeniable chemistry on screen, and fans were convinced that they were also dating in real life. However, both actors have denied that they were ever romantically involved. In a 2018 interview, Bullock said that she had a crush on Reeves while they were filming Speed, but she didn't think that he felt the same way. Reeves has also said that he admires Bullock deeply, but that their relationship has always been platonic. Keanu Reeves and Amanda de Cadenet met in 1996. They dated sporadically for six years and remained friends after breaking up. In a 2022 interview, de Cadenet said that Reeves is part of my extended family and that she is really grateful for him. She also praised Reeves for his kindness and authenticity, saying that he is the most unfamous famous person ever. Keanu Reeves and Jennifer Syme met in 1998 at a party for Reeves's band Dogstar. They reportedly fell in love instantly and moved in together shortly after. In 1999, Syme became pregnant with their first child. However, their daughter Ava was stillborn on Christmas Eve that year. The tragic loss of their child put a strain on their relationship, and they broke up in early 2000. However, they remained close friends and were reportedly back together in 2001. On April 2, 2001, 
Syme died in a car accident at the age of 28. Reeves was devastated by her death, and he has rarely spoken about it in public. However, he has said that she was the love of his life. Diane Keaton and Keanu Reeves met on the set of the 2003 romantic comedy film Something's Gotta Give, in which they played love interests. They had an 18-year age gap, but they reportedly had a strong connection. There have been long-standing rumors that Keaton and Reeves also became romantically involved off-screen, but neither of them has ever confirmed or denied this. In a 2006 interview with Oprah Winfrey, Keaton joked, I'm going to marry him, he likes an older woman. However, she also said that she didn't want to talk about her personal life in public. Keanu Reeves was linked to Claire Forlani from 2004 to 2006. While the couple never publicly confirmed their relationship, they were often seen together in public and were photographed kissing and cuddling. There were also rumors that the couple had gotten engaged, but these rumors were never confirmed. In 2006, Reeves told the New York Daily News that he and Forlani were just good friends. Kelly Garner and Keanu Reeves were rumored to be dating in 2005, but neither of them ever confirmed the relationship. They met on the set of the film The Thumbsucker, in which they played a couple. Garner has spoken fondly of Reeves in interviews, saying that he is a great guy and that she had a wonderful time working with him. However, she has also said that they were never more than friends. Keanu Reeves and Lynn Collins met on the set of the 2006 film The Lake House. They began dating shortly after and were together for about seven months. Their relationship was reportedly very private, and they rarely spoke about it publicly. However, they were seen together on several occasions and were photographed looking very happy together. In March 2007, it was reported that Reeves and Collins had broken up. Keanu Reeves and Martha Higareta met on the set of the movie Street Kings in 2007. They were later photographed together at the Beverly Wilshire Hotel in Los Angeles, and some media outlets reported that they were dating. In a 2008 interview, Higareta spoke about her relationship with Reeves, saying that he was a great guy and that they had a lot of fun working together on Street Kings. However, she also said that they were just friends. In 2008, Keanu Reeves and Parker Posey were spotted having dinner together at the Chateau Marmont Hotel in Los Angeles, and there were reports that they were dating. However, neither of them ever confirmed the rumors. In a 2012 interview, Posey said that she and Reeves were just friends, but she also said that she had a lot of respect for him as an actor and a person. She said, Keanu is one of the most genuine and kind people I know. He's also a very talented actor. I'm so grateful to have him as a friend. In 2008, there were rumors that Keanu Reeves and Trini Woodall were dating, but these rumors were quickly debunked. In 2010, Woodall was quoted in an interview saying that she and Reeves were just friends. She said that they had a lot in common, such as their love of motorcycles and their shared sense of humor. Keanu Reeves and China Chow had a brief relationship in 2008. They were first spotted together in June of that year, when they were photographed topless while on vacation in the French Riviera. They were also seen together on several other occasions, including at a Lakers game and a Hollywood party. However, the relationship reportedly fizzled out after just a few months. Charlize Theron and Keanu Reeves have starred in two films together. The Devil's Advocate, 1997, and Sweet November, 2001. There have been rumors that Theron and Reeves have dated, but neither actor has ever confirmed this. In 2020, Theron posted a photo of herself and Reeves on Instagram on his birthday, with the caption, I love this handsome human so much. Happy birthday, Keanu. You're just the best. This led to renewed speculation about their relationship, but neither actor has commented on it publicly. Cameron Diaz and Keanu Reeves have been friends for years and even appeared in one movie together, Feeling Minnesota, 1996. In 2009, there were rumors that they were dating, but neither actor ever confirmed the relationship. In an interview with The Sun, 
Diaz said that she and Reeves are just friends. She said that they have great chemistry on screen, but that they are not romantically involved. Keanu Reeves and Alexandra Grant are one of Hollywood's most beloved couples. They have been together for over four years, and their relationship is known for being private and supportive. Reeves and Grant first met in 2009 at a dinner party, but they didn't start dating until a few years later. They collaborated on several creative projects together, including Reeves's books, Ode to Happiness and Shadows. In 2019, Reeves and Grant made their public debut as a couple at the MoCA Gala in Los Angeles. They have been inseparable ever since, and they often attend events together. Reeves and Grant are both private people, so they don't often talk about their relationship in public. However, they have both spoken about how much they love and respect each other.